guys, Jessica Gardner here with UT Extension in Clark County and today we're outside enjoying the beautiful weather but also getting our, in our physical activity. So the difference between moderate and vigorous activity, moderate activity you're going to increase your heart rate slightly um, but you still are, are going to be able to talk but you're not going to be able to sing. So something like I'm doing now, just walking at a slow to brisk pace is going to get my heart rate up enough that I can still carry on a conversation but I'm not going to be able to sing to you. But if I were doing vigorous activity, so vigorous activity, I'm not gonna be able to even talk. So my heart rate is extremely elevated. I'm doing something intense, maybe running or jogging or bicycling, something that um, requires more effort, more energy exertion. So when I set these um, exercise goals for myself, if I'm inactive and I haven't been doing anything, but now that the weather's nice and I want to um, get outside more, I'm gonna start small, start with small achievable goals. So that may just be walking up and down the driveway or walking up and down the neighborhood once a day and then you can maybe bump it up to twice a day so as you get more comfortable and your body gets accustomed to doing these things to making these small changes then you can add on to it so you can maybe walk for 10 minutes a day and then 15 minutes a day so you want to set yourself up for success so don't set ridiculous goals that you know you can't achieve so maybe not even making a goal to do something every single day maybe every other day that way it's more achievable and if you do go the extra mile and you do it every day you feel so much better about yourself because you went above and beyond so i encourage you to enjoy this beautiful weather and get outside and do some physical activity